Hello everyone, in this scene we follow St. Charles, a desperate attempt to get money from Sarah. He calls her repeatedly but she doesn't answer his calls. Despite this, St. Charles remains convinced that if he tells Jihoon about Sarah's pregnancy with his baby, Sarah will be kicked out by Jaeguk. On top of that, St. Charles is dealing with intense hunger which only worsens when he realizes his own poverty. Sang Chol tries to convince Han Mari to go with him to Bobby Chang to ask for free food. But Han Mari refuses she would rather starve than endure a just insult. So Sang Chol decides to go alone, planning to eat for free at Bobby Chang and bring food back for Han Mari. To the surprise, when Sang Chol arrives at Bobby Chang, he strikes gold. Instead of getting free food, he stumbles upon Bobby's stolen jewelry, which Sharon and Aja had taken. Sang Chol makes a promise to himself that he'll disappear with the jewelry, but deep down he knows it's impossible. As a bigger and a shameless person, he will always need money, so he'll eventually return to Saran if he runs out. Furthermore, Saran is now unable to touch or claim Bobby's property. She cannot pay Sang Chol, Young Sik, or Mr. Kim. They won't have the money to keep them silent. Eventually, one by one, they may approach Jaeguk, the Jong, and Jihoon. Mr. Kim may seek the Jong and request money for the information he possesses. Sang Chol may meet Jihoon, and Young Sik may approach Jaeguk to reveal that Saran is not Bobby's biological granddaughter. Now the question arises: What will Jaeguk do if he discovers that Saran is not Bobby's biological granddaughter? Will he chase her away or keep her by his side, hiding the truth because she is profitable for him? Okay everyone, that's the scene for this time and thank you for watching my video.